All right, at the top of the mix here, we want to start with stereotypes and knocking them down. Folks, take a moment, close your eyes, and imagine a female engineer and what comes to mind, or even just an engineer, I should say. And the first thing that comes to mind is probably not this young lady, and that is what we're challenging. Wow. This is an ad here uh, for a firm. You see the T-shirt she's wearing, uh, One Login, I believe the name of it, but engineering company is out in the Bay Area. They put up these ads, which is essentially trying to attract engineers. And this one got a lot of attention because this young lady posted this along with something on her Facebook page, and it got a lot of attention because nobody thinks that's what an engineer is supposed to look like. She's so beautiful. There you go, right? And so it got, I guess you could say, some negative attention, thinking that the company was just, okay, you, 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 she's too she's beautiful to be an engineer. So you're just, this is a ploy, if you will. You plucked her out. So she posted this afterwards, saying what she does, saying, hey, I help build enterprise software, hashtag I look like an engineer. That then started a movement online, people using that hashtag, other female engineers. Uh, yes, I look uh -huh. like an engineer. We all look like an engineer. It's not what you might imagine, what you think of, but it started a little movement and knocked down these stereotypes. It's been a big deal trying to get more women and young girls into some of these uh, the, the STEM fields. Yes. And here you go. So important. And to see that they're cool and they seem very personable, and I think it's a wonderful campaign, yeah. especially for young girls. Some, remember Whole Foods? They had this whole controversy over the scales that would weigh the products at Whole Foods, that some of them were really off. Okay. They were overcharging people. Well, now the... An editor over at the LA Times Magazine found this, asparagus water being sold by Whole Foods. So the associate editor at the LA Times, at the LA Magazine, posted this and then wrote the caption, somewhere in LA, Whole Foods execs are laughing at all of us. And you see the 16 ounce veggie water, which by the way, retails for $5.99. It's not okay. a different, it's Whole Foods who put it together and tried to sell it. What and is asparagus water, what is that? Whole Foods says it was meant to be like the essence of asparagus in water. You know, they have like alkaline water. Mean? It's like we had so many different flavored waters, right? So it's supposed to be like a flavored water. And so they're apologizing. They pulled it from Brentwood Hills <laughs> Whole Foods and it's not going to be sold anymore. What's the cucumber water you get when you're on at the resort? No. That stuff is delicious. Yeah. I'm not so sure about asparagus water. <laughs> okay. One last thing here. Let me show you this contraption. This is from a company called Genworth. They put this on you. This is supposed to help you, you young folks. Feel what it's like to be 70 years old. This oh. puts you into your 70-year-old self. It uh, changes your muscle mass, your hearing, and your vision, give you a better appreciation of the body you have and maybe even of some older folks Love out it. there. Love it.